Whew. All right, guys, on a hot, hot Tuesday, I wanted to do this video just to show you that uh, the power of the mini dumpster, okay, the power of the mini dumpster. We're here in Frisco, Texas. Now, this neighborhood, you have to actually put a code in to come into this neighborhood. And I've been in this neighborhood for over the last month about five to six times. And that's only one reason. And the reason is that thing, the power of the mini dumpster. Okay, so I just set another mini dumpster. Check out these cones I put up. See, I always put cones and all my mini dumpsters. No, I'm lying. I'm lying. I found those mini dumpsters in my dumpster. Uh, but the point about it is that here's another mini dumpster rental right here for 150 bucks in this neighborhood. This is the third one in this neighborhood. But what's incredible about this, I've done over maybe five other junk removal single items in this neighborhood because of that dumpster. That dumpster has given me the ability to do single items in this neighborhood because they see the dumpster, they want to rent it, and they think that I'm going to charge $150 for like a couch to throw in there. No, no, no. It's $75, $85 for a single item. So I talk to them, they call me, they give me a call, they see the phone number on it. And this is the magic and the power of the mini dumpster. This mini dumpster brings me so much business all the time. And I think I've told people the marketing that's behind this dumpster is incredible. I just set this down on properties and... I let it do its thing. And, and the thing about it, this neighborhood, if you recognize it from another video, I've been here uh, numerous, numerous times, okay? Like I said, over the last month, I think I've been here about, I don't know, eight times? But there's the mini dumpster. That's one of the oldest ones, kind of got rust and stuff. But it's still good, it's efficient, it's clean, and well, it's right there. Look at this neighborhood, how it is. The driveways are really small, so I've learned how to put the dumpster in very tight spot by putting it sideways instead of putting it up you know the way it's supposed to go so i put that sideways here's what's going to happen a customer uh, an another neighbor is going to drive by they're going to see this dumpster and they're going to call it and they're going to go wow what a great idea check out this dumpster in this neighborhood they'll see this dumpster and they'll give me a call but they'll ask me questions like well i only got a tv can i put a tv in there well look, no ma'am why don't you just let me come out there? I'll charge you a cheaper price than 150 bucks, and then I don't have to drop the mini dumpster. I'll make money off a single item, and that's what I'll what I'll do. It's a better thing for me to do that. Um, this is cool because last time I came here, I picked up the mini dumpster that was one street over, right? And I picked up that mini dumpster, and here's what I'll tell you what I did. Okay, I picked up the mini dumpster, and then on the way out, I picked up the couch. So there it is. On the way in, when I dropped it off, I picked up a water, two water heaters from a house. So I picked up two water heaters on the way in, dropping it off, and on the way out, picking it up like a week later, I picked up a couch. So there it is. The power of the mini dumpster is incredible. Uh, always a marketing masterpiece. So I just wanted to show you all something that was really, uh, well, something I don't talk about very much, but I use these. I don't make much money dropping them off. Where I make money is the marketing off of it. So a lot of people say, hey, I spend this much on Google AdWords. Well, here's my Google AdWords right there. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I just wanted to show the power marketing of the mini. Bye-bye, guys. Don't forget to subscribe over there to the right side. On the left side, check out my other videos. I'll talk to you all later.